bucks. That's two weeks overdue. Rapid time. The Producers is uh, about a man named Max Bialystok, who's really down on his luck, used to be the king of Broadway, and he has fallen on some very, very hard times. And all of his shows seem to be flops. And then a man by the name of Leo Bloom comes into his life, an accountant, and uh, tells him that it is easier to make money on a flop than with a hit. Well, it's simply a matter of creative accounting. Then they go and f try to find the absolute worst play, the one that would guarantee to close on opening night. Springtime for Hitler, a gay romp with Adolf and Ava at Berchtesgaden. Oh my God. <laughs> my favorite thing about the producers is probably uh, the humor. Um, Mel Brooks has always been a hero of mine, and uh, his comedy is, although racy, um, always really funny and poignant. It is insanely funny. Nothing is safe. Everything will be made fun of, and everything is hilarious. You've already had your toilet break. I'm not going into the toilet. I'm going into show business. This role is a bucket list role for me. I've wanted to do it uh, ever since I was in high school. We'll never quit. I love this musical, and this is one of my dream of dream roles. Brian's the perfect Max. Matt is the perfect Leo. Tyler, Colton, and Aaron are unbelievable, so just being able to consistently match that was the most challenging thing. Shout out, and Emma Goldberg is amazing. Absolutely fantastic. Lights, music, happy tippy tappy toes. The amount of talent in this show is so high that I, this whole time I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm uh, like, a, like, a, like a swan and my feet are just paddling as fast as they can to just keep up with everyone else in this show. It's just a great production. This My favorite thing about the show is that it is at 100% energy level the whole time. Um, it's just so high energy and so much fun. Very high energy, very fun. A lot of things going on all at one time, so you can come see the show multiple times and you will see something different every single time. Everything I do, I do for you. Yes, you do. If you're looking for a war, here's World War to heal myself. This music it definitely is different from previous shows I've done and previous shows you probably have seen. It's, it's hilarious, all of the lyrics themselves. It's loud and it's in your face. And there are definitely some show-stopping tunes th throughout this whole show. I want to be the greatest, grandest, and most fabulous producer in the world. The choreography in this show is pretty phenomenal. It's traditional and also very modern at the same time. Stevie Simmons and J.D. Phelps together put together a pretty seamless show of choreography. I think it will blow the audiences away. The choreography is amazing, the storyline is hilarious, and you're in for just a really good time when you come see us. The last thing they're after is a litany of woe. What people can expect to see when they come see the producers is classic Mel Brooks. <laughs> Everything can be made fun of, and no one is safe. So you will laugh top to bottom at things you never thought you would laugh at. People should expect to be pushed out of their comfort zone a little bit, but to laugh really hard while it's happening. As the Academy Director, I should probably tell you that the show does contain some adult humor and adult situations. But it's still really funny. Oh, this is Bedlam. Bedlam. This show is by far one of the uh, funniest shows that uh, GTC has put on in their years, and uh, I'm so excited to be a part of it.